Hi, it's K Bar user. I do believe I'm done camping. This was the last place I know I could go to camp that wasn't bought up or posted or whatever. Uh, police showed up, informed me that there was a fire ban, which I didn't know about, of course, so there's a tip for you. Just check your local fire department, see if there is a fire ban in your area. So I had to put the fire out. Then the property owner showed up as I was packing up. And this has been bought out by another person. And they don't want anybody on it. And the gentleman was very polite. Just explaining to me they bought this for deer hunting. And uh, doesn't mind if I come down here on day trips or whatever, but no overnighters. It is very dry out here. It hasn't rained here in any substantial and rain anyway in a couple of weeks. Um, so that's that's that. It's very sad to say that at one point in time, anywhere I could go, as far as I wanted to walk, and be able to camp there overnight. I guess progress takes its toll, huh? So, I'm packed up, I'm ready to leave. I just figured I'd bring you this, uh, Sad evening news that I was really looking forward to being on her for tonight. So, tip number one check with your local fire department, see if there is a fire ban in your area. Just sitting it's been so dry here. If it's like that in your area, check before you go. Tip number two don't take it for granted that property hasn't been sold out that you don't even know of. <sighs> Alright, well, this is K Bar user. I don't expect you to like the video, but if you do, please hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, please do. And uh, we'll see you on the next day trip. You have a good one.